what is elapsed time elapsed time is the amount of time passed between start of an event to end of an event so what is start time when the event begins and the end time is when the event ends and elapsed time is just the difference between the start time and the end time and the formula for that is elapsed time equal to end time minus start time for example if you start watching a movie at 4 pm and finishes at 6 pm the elapsed time is only 2 hours that is 6 minus 4 is 2 hours elapsed time helps to calculate duration of activities let's see an example find elapsed time in hours and minutes between 1652 hours and 2143 hours so this is 24 hour clock and our formula for elapsed time is n time minus start time so n time here is 2143 hours minus 1652 hours first this is 24 hour clock so first two digits are for hours and the next two digits are for minutes so it's 21 hours 43 minutes and 16 hours 52 minutes let's write it like hours and minutes because we want our answer in hours and minutes now let's arrange them in the subtraction format 21 hours 43 minutes at the first and 16 hours 52 minutes at the second place now we need a lot of area here for the calculation So forty three minus fifty two in subtraction of the time we see the numbers together to check that the subtraction is possible or not. So forty three minus fifty two is not possible. So forty three needs a carry or sorry a borrow from twenty one. So twenty one will give one hour to the minutes and will become twenty and one hour. will be given to minutes so we already know one hour equal to 60 minutes so it will give 60 basically to the minutes so 43 plus 60 will be 0 plus 3 is 3 and 6 plus 4 is 10 now the subtraction is possible 103 and 52 now we'll take one digit first that is 3 minus 2 is 1 10 minus 5 is 5 so we have 51 minutes now 0 minus 6 is not possible 0 will borrow 1 from 2 so 2 will give 1 to the 0 so it will become 1 and this will become 10 10 minus 6 is 4 and 1 minus 1 is 0 so it's 4 hours 51 minutes as our answer we have just done the subtraction like we have done in the other video for the subtraction of time you can watch my video for this uh, detailed understanding how to do subtraction of time so the b part is 4:35 am and 6:20 pm now this is not in a 24 hour clock the 12 hour clock let's convert this into 24 hour clock first because we need hours and minutes so for conversion you can watch my other video on converting 12 to 24 hour clock i'll share link in the description so it's very easy am will remain same that is 0435 hours and 620 as it's the pm so 6 will add 12 to the 6 so it will become 4 uh, 435 hours and 18 6 plus 12 is 18 18 20 hours now the formula for elapsed time n time minus start time so n time here is 18 20 hours minus 435 minutes so we'll write 1820 first and then 4 hours 35 minutes in second place now we'll do subtraction let's check 20 minus 35 is possible it's not possible we can't subtract it so 20 will borrow 1 from 18 and 18 will become 17 and 1 hour we already know is 60 minutes so when 1 hour is giving to minute it's 60 it's basically giving 60 to the minutes So now let's add zero plus zero will be zero. Six plus two will be eight. So we have eighty now. Now zero minus five. Now we'll do the subtraction digit by digit. So zero minus five is not possible. Zero will borrow one from 
8 became 7, 10, this will become 10, and 10 minus 5 is 5, 7 minus 3, 4 minutes, that is 45 minutes, 7 minus 4 is 3 and 1 as it is, so it's 13 hours, 45 minutes, so our answer we have, the elapsed time between these two time are 13 hours, 45 minutes. So this way you can find elapsed time easily. Just the formula is end time minus start time. The exercise is for you. Do some workout. So find the elapsed time between 12, 10 hours and the 14, 30 hours. After solving this, then you can check your answer. I have written there. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like. And don't forget to hit the bell icon for the notifications of our upcoming videos. Bye-bye.